and gentlemen. <laughs> It's time Hobo! Hey, this is Tide Eye Hobo over here in beautiful Hawaii where the sun's always shining and it's always beautiful. So whenever you want to come back to the big island of Hawaii, come on over and check out Tide Eye Hobo or just Google it. Today, um, we're doing double header. I did one earlier. I could do them all day long if I wanted to, you know what I mean? <laughs> but we're going to do another one of a suggestion, a request on the suggestion video I did a few videos ago. And um, I'm going to do some bandanas. All right? So we're going to do some patriotic ones. And so we'll see how they turn out, okay? So let's check it out. Oh, yeah. Thanks, God, for all the talent and all the blessings. Thanks, Jesus. So I can share with everybody. Thanks, Lord. So sharing's important, you know. If you share, it's priceless. If you don't share, it's worthless. So okay, let's check it out, okay? Okay. I get these flower sack cloths at Walmart. And they're pretty cool. They're, they're like 18 by 18. Anyways, they're good for bandanas and doilies <laughs> anyway so here we got spread it all out i'm gonna do two at a time because they're so thin i can get away with that so i'm gonna show you guys how you can get away with two at a time okay so right here get it all straighten up nothing has to be perfect just get it as best you can get on the ring see how i did that like beep 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 Pops out all the wrinkles like. Okay, now I'm gonna fold it in half and do that wrinkle pop. And what I'm gonna do right now, I'm just gonna grab it like this and then pop it out a little bit. And then now that it's all wrinkle free again. Okay, now we're gonna do we're gonna fold it in half one more time. So just like kind of folding a, a towel. Okay. Now this one last part here, I'm going to do fold this diagonally. So what I do is I do this imaginary score down the middle like that. And it kind of folds easier like that. Okay. Okay, now it kind of looks like a triangle almost. Now this part right here, I usually start about six inches in. And I fold it over like that. And then... It's probably about inch in length. And I'm gonna just fold it like that. And then fold that one like that. And then like that. Now I have it like that. I'm gonna pull it against myself right here. And I'm gonna do the same thing. See how I did that? I'm gonna grab it like about a, in there. Okay. Nothing has to be perfect, okay? just make some pretty colors this is gonna be patriotic okay so now we have this funny looking thing like that so we get the rubber bands and we get a three fingers slide underneath all the way and right down the middle okay and do that one like that about a couple inches and then I think I had to double this one up right here okay and then right here at the end. And then turn that around, do the same thing. And double this up here. Okay. See that? Okay, we're gonna leave that for a side for a second. We're gonna take that the dining rack together with this one. This one here. This one here, actually, you know what, the, the cheese, the flower, flower sack cloths come already kind of folded up like this. So, it's already full in half, so 
I'm going to just fold it like this right now in half. Okay. So now we have it like that. Okay. And this one here, again, we're going to do the same thing. When this is kind of like folds, it's kind of boring to me, man. Pleats and folds, but so what I usually do is I go up like this, and then like, in half like that, like about two inches or whatever, and back again, and back again, and then I pull it against myself like this, and I kind of pin, pull it, pinch and pull. See that? And you can really spend a lot of time doing this, you know, and go really perfect, you know, and it's just, it's just a bandana, man, you know. All right, so now we're going to do the, <laughs> yeah, it's just a t-shirt, man. It's not like it's going on oil painting or can be preserved behind glass or something, you know, or in a climate controlled area. <laughs> okay, so there we go. Now we have these two items. We're going to go take them to the dye rack and dye them. Hang on. Okay, now I'm going to get the... Uh, you're supposed to wear gloves when you're doing this, but I don't wear them. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. We're going to start off with blue down the center. Like this. This is a uh, navy blue. I figure it's about as blue as patriotic as you can get. And then red so i usually i just get um do it on both sides just uh, leave a little space in between there because it's it is going to be white it's going to be white in there no matter what and then we'll do the blue again on this side here same thing leave a little space so um yeah i get three primary colors like you know and then i mix the colors so like i get fuchsia so the fuchsia, I have to add a little bit of yellow to it, and it makes it a uh, fire red. All right. So now we're going to get this and flip it over. So I'm going to touch the dark stuff and then flip it right over. Do the same thing on this side here. And I'm just going to go right where the blue was at, right over here. Okay, these are bandanas, you know, you're, you want to get crazy with your pricing, you know, because people will wear them more if you charge less. You charge a lot, they wear them less, and you have less advertisement. So, figure it out, you know. Greed kills. Okay, so here we go. We have this little patriotic looking thing, and I'll open that up and show you what it looks like in a few. Now, here's this other one here. We're going to do something similar to that. I'm just going to go straight up and down this right here. Right there. I'm going to do red on the ends. Make it simple. Okay. Really simple, right? Tie-dye is supposed to be fun. Leave stress at the door. Okay. So here we go. We're going to flip this over right here like that. Do the same thing. When you get down the road, you know, you can do these interlocking things. Like you can do one color on one side and another on the other and flip it back and forth. And it really looks cool. But we're just doing patriotic colors right now. And there we go. So I'll open these up and show you what they look like in a few minutes here. Okay. All right. Check it out. Say hi. Say hi, Chi Chi. All right, here we go, man. Let's check it out. Here's the first one. All right. All right. Here's the other one. All right. That's cool. Okay, here's the second one. All 
There we go. See, when you put them on his bandanas, you know, they'd be red, white, blue. I hope you guys appreciate that. And, you know, if you want to help support, shop tie-dyehobo.com for your custom-made tie-dyes. All right, thanks. Aloha. 